Hey, what's going on? Ray Del Vecchio here from WebsiteProfitCourse.com. In this quick tutorial, we'll walk through the steps to sign up with SiteGround and install WordPress to create your first website or blog. And I'm passionate about this topic because I believe every person should start a website or a blog to publish their ideas online. It's helped me tremendously with my writing and my communication. I know it can do it for you. And there's many ways to do it nowadays, but WordPress to me is the most professional and flexible. And plus the whole process from start to finish, it's only gonna take about eight minutes of hands-on work. So don't be intimidated if you're not a computer geek. You can get this done and we'll walk through exactly how to do it. I'm on the SiteGround homepage right now and we're just moving into January 2020. You can see they got a little holiday banner up here. But what I wanna do is pop over to WordPress's website because they recommend three hosting companies and SiteGround makes the list as one of the top ones. They've been around since 2004 and they host over 2 million domains. So you can trust that you'll be on the best platform as a website beginner. I will include a link to SiteGround in the description below. I'm a SiteGround affiliate, so that means I earn a commission if you purchase using my link. And that support helps me create free tutorials like this one that you're watching. Plus, I have a complete WordPress 101 training series that you can join at the end of this video, so stick around for that. Here are the four main options that SiteGround gives you. And if you look at the features for the first three, you'll notice that they all have the same basic technology. They're all the same price, and you just get a few extra features whether you are starting with WordPress or whether you are starting with WooCommerce, which is an e-commerce plugin for WordPress. It's probably the most popular e-commerce platform on WordPress. And the highest level package that they have is this cloud hosting. But for today, I'm 100% sure that we're gonna set up a WordPress blog. So I'm gonna get started with managed WordPress hosting. And here they show you their three packages. They have a startup package, grow big, and go geek. And they show you the special introductory price along with the regular price that it's gonna renew at. So they give you a great discount here on your first invoice. And the main difference is that the startup package is for one website, whereas the next two are for unlimited websites. And you also get more web space along with bandwidth in terms of the monthly visits that your website can handle. And if you wanna get into the nitty gritty features, you can just hover over these links and they'll show you what, what this comes with. So the essential WordPress features are a free WordPress install, free migration if you already have a WordPress website on another host, you get free SSL, email, a CDN, which is gonna speed up your website, that stands for a content delivery network, daily backups, auto updates for WordPress, which is pretty cool, and 24 seven support. So we're gonna go for the startup plan here. I'll click the get plan button. And first we need to either import a domain that we've already registered, or this is where we can register our domain name. And I'm gonna register a new one. I'm gonna build this blog for my sister. And she's still figuring out what she's gonna write about. The domain that she chose was betterwithpups.com. So I'll paste that in here. And of course, you know, this is gonna have to do with her dog. She also might want to do things related to home, beauty, or travel. It's gonna be open-ended, but I have to show you a couple pictures of her dog. His name's Enzo. I usually watch him a handful of weeks out of the year, and he's really a great dude. Super well-behaved, very friendly, and I can tell you every time I take him out, he gets compliments, <laughs> especially because of his coat. He's got that brindle coat, kinda of looks like a cheetah and he runs like one too. <laughs> so let's go ahead and register this domain. And our domain name is available. So we just need to finish this checkout page and we'll be good to go. So the first thing is the account information. You wanna set your email and password. Down here is your billing information. You wanna put in your name, your address, your zip, your phone number. You have your payment information. And then down here, this is where we can alter our packages. So right now we have the startup plan. It's set to 12 months. And like I said, it's gonna rebuild at 11.95 a month. So I wanna lock in this initial price. I'm gonna extend the term to 36 months. And then under the extra services here, we have our domain registration. I'm also gonna add on domain privacy. And if you don't know anything about this, when you register a domain, your, your contact information is gonna be publicly available. That might include your address, your phone number, your email address. 
So unless you add this domain privacy, people are going to be able to look that up. And it's not a major deal either way, but obviously for $12 a year, it's probably a no-brainer for you. And you can see down here that our total is $170.15. So once you finish up, all you have to do is check off these checkboxes and click the Pay Now button. So I'm going to go through this and fill out my sister's information to get her set up, and I'll join you on the next page. All right, I just finished checkout here, and we can see that our account was successfully created, and there's a button below to log into the customer area. And they also mention here that you're going to receive welcome emails. I got a receipt along with information on how to log in. And then I also got this email over here notifying me to verify the domain name. And they give you a link here to click and follow the instructions. So I'm going to leave that to you. Let me just go back to SiteGround and we'll check out our customer area. They're giving us the option to either create our website or migrate a website to our new domain name. So let me click the Set Up Site button. And we want to start a new website. They give you the option here to use WordPress, WooCommerce, or Weebly. We're going to go with WordPress. And we're able to set our WordPress email address and password here. And when we're ready, we can click Continue. And they have a little upsell here for their SG site scanner. I'm just going to click the finish button. And they're creating our site right now. It's going to be ready in less than two minutes. They do give us our name servers down here under this point your domain section. And the name servers are what link your domain name to SiteGround hosting. This is how you would link up a domain that was registered somewhere else to SiteGround. And they tell us that we can immediately start managing our site by clicking on this button here. So here's our dashboard. We can see the name servers that we just got on that previous page. There's the pin tools here that you can edit by clicking this little pencil icon up here. You can see you can add apps, manage your email accounts, manage your files, or set up the CDN. They also provide website stats for you. And now that I have this set up, I want to open this domain name in a new tab and see if we have our WordPress website ready to go. So let me do that. And there we are. This is a, a very plain, basic WordPress installation. You can start blogging immediately, or obviously if you want to work on the design a little bit, you're going to want to look into WordPress themes. You can install free or paid WordPress themes to give you a nice template that you can start with for customization. And then right here you have a login button in order to log into your website. And the other way that you can get to your WordPress login page is by going to yourdomainname.com slash WP dash admin. And that will automatically take you to your WordPress login page. And I'm going to copy and paste the login info that I used to create this WordPress account. And when I log in here, SiteGround's going to show you this little wizard to get set up. You can go through this if you like. I'm just going to exit it. And now we've reached the WordPress dashboard. And that's it. We got WordPress launched, and we're ready to start building. So if that seemed easy enough for you, don't wait any longer. Take action right now on your website or blog. Go to WebsiteProfitCourse.com slash SiteGround to sign up for web hosting today. And like I mentioned before, as a SiteGround affiliate, I earn a commission if you purchase using the link in the description. And that support helps me create free tutorials like this free WordPress training that you can use to get set up and customize your WordPress site. So if you're a WordPress beginner or want to brush up on the basics, this free training is going to show you exactly how to use WordPress, a complete overview of the dashboard that we just landed on. You'll even see how to build a website step by step from scratch. I'll link that up here in the top right in the description below, and you can also go to WebsiteProfitCourse.com slash WP101. And if this video helped you launch, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so you get all future WordPress tutorials. If you have a question, leave it in the comments below. I'll do my best to give you an answer or at least point you in the right direction. And I want to thank you for watching this entire video. I started my first website probably about 11 or 12 years ago right now. and 
I've been obsessed with the online world ever since. There's so many opportunities out there. If you have a website, it doesn't matter if you're looking for a new job, looking to make money online, you want to freelance, you want to create an online business, you want to create an e-commerce business. The only way you're going to get there is by starting right now. So don't waste any more time. Head over to SiteGround and go make your website idea a reality. Thanks a lot, and I hope you join me on the next video. Have a great day.